Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of the weapons of hot dogs, horseshoes and hand grenades. Today we are traveling to Ukraine to take a look at this pistol. This is the F12 in game or the 412, a uh, double action, single action, semi-automatic pistol for uh, the Ukrainians, which uh, well the Ukrainians used. So uh, it, it started its development in the mid. 90s. The Soviet Union had been dissolved. Ukraine is independent. And the Ukrainians are like, we have this Makarov. It is very out of date, to be honest. So let's make a new one. So Fort, a uh, weapons uh, manufacturer in Ukraine, um, designed and started building the Fort 12. And uh, they have four weapons to this. Which uh, they decided to chamber in 9mm Makarov, Ukraine, former Soviet state, not a lot of money makes sense but they still did it properly they got some tooling from the Czech Republic at the time I believe might have still been Czechoslovakia I believe it was the Czech Republic at that time and uh, they built a um, semi-automatic blowback pistol so as mentioned it is in let's get that bullet in 9mm Makarov, or 9x18, which is smaller than Parabellum. I do prefer Parabellum. It is a double action, so hammer down. Or single action. Hammer is now up. Classic pistol sights. Forgot to mention. It has a uh, double stack magazine. So I'm not quite sure how many bullets there are in it. So we'll take a look at that now. Twelve bullets. So uh, not a lot of bullets. It has a uh, slide hold open. But the twelve bullets certainly more than the eight bullets of the Makarov. It's still not amazing. Western designs have more like 15 in that range with 9mm parabell. But this is a nice and small compact pistol. And it is certainly better than the Makarov. And because it is 9mm Makarov instead of Parabellum, it has less recoil. But it is a solid pistol. It's uh, used currently by Ukraine. I'm not quite sure what in Ukraine, but I believe police and such. I believe the military uses an updated um, m updated uh, fort pistol, but don't quote, quote me on that. But in game, we have this uh, simple fort pistol. Um, I'm not quite sure on attachments. We will take a look. I don't think it can have a uh, red dot. But, I mean, let's just get a uh, compact red dot to try. I don't believe so. But I do believe it can have a uh, flashlight. So we'll take this flashlight and uh, we'll take a look. Doesn't seem to be working. Can I take a flashlight? Doesn't look like it'll take a flashlight. I, I do know that uh, the, the Ukrainians did develop a flashlight for it, but I'm not sure how much it's used. Um, right, let's reset the target. Let's take a look at the sheet and let's see how accurate we can be. This pistol is apparently more accurate than a Makarov. And Bro, why didn't you keep track? Bro. But if we take a look, it might be hard for you guys to see. I, I kept it all within the gray area at least. So it is reasonable enough, accurate. I don't expect a lot. It's a pistol. So uh, I think that uh, covers the 412. I do hope you all enjoy. Be sure to be leave a like, subscribe and all of that. And I'll uh, catch you guys in the next one. Bye.